Since the launch of Marketing Edge magazine into the Nigeria print media market, the story has never been the same. Not only has the 19 years old print publication heralded a new genre of journalism tagged brand journalism with its unique features and specialties, Marketing Edge has through a series of innovations and avant-garde ideations changed the paradigm albeit positively. Upon debut, the magazine left no one in doubt about its self-appointed tax of promoting the brand idea while expanding the frontiers of marketing and advertising knowledge. At the back of its coming was the vision to be the best, authoritative and avant-garde leading source of news and deep market insights seven brand marketing ecosystem we embark on this journey purposely to promote the brand idea either though the brand journalism practice was non-existent the industry was underreported and during my days as a reporter, correspondent with this day newspaper, I was given the beat to cover the marketing and advertising sector. In the course of reporting the beat, I discovered, to my surprise, that the marketing and advertising sector was largely underreported. Meanwhile, Players and gladiators in the industry were contributing very hugely to the Nigeria gross domestic products. They were neither reported nor they were recognized. After leaving this day, along with my team, we set up, we pioneered this initiative, which is a new journey in journalism. And this new journey of journalism has its own special registers that makes it distinct from general bit reporting. Since then, there has been no looking back in the journey. And having done this religiously, passionately, and professionally for a decade, Marketing Edge launched the National Marketing Stakeholders Summit and Brands and Advertising Awards of Excellence as a yearly industry initiative aimed at rewarding creative excellence in brand advertising while setting new standards and benchmarks for global competitiveness. The introduction of the yearly summit and awards created unprecedented excitement and joy for industry players and stakeholders who had for long been looking forward to such a competitive initiative. Today, the Marketing Edge National Marketing Stakeholders Summit and Brands and Advertising Awards of Excellence has become a sorrowy success in its ninth year of existence. The initiative has recorded tremendous growth since inception, rewarding outstanding brands, market makers, gladiators and players while expanding the frontiers of knowledge and the business of brand management and the management of brand business. We come up with the service and award initiative primarily to create more excitement and robust engagement with all the players in the sector. The National Summit is a national and global event in which we initiate a contemporary topic and we get different uh, professionals in the Nigeria Integrated Marketing Communications to engage in conversation, productive in co conversation on contemporary issues that will further help in expanding the frontiers of marketing and advertising knowledge. The awards is meant to recognize, reward, and encourage creativity, creative excellence in the different sectors of the industry as well as across the industries. We also try to create an ambience, a social ambience, where we can bond borders in the private sector with the power, the political elites. We are doing this 
as a further as, as, a, as a way of further encouraging recognition for those people who are engaged in the business of brand management and the management of brand business. And of course, the award we've given over the years have gone a long way in stimulating positive competitive practice, you know, among various players and uh, operators. Keep up with innovative, revealing, and groundbreaking happenings in the world of brands and brand builders in Nigeria and across the globe. Not satisfied with itself, the magazine launched a new initiative in the electronic media through the creation of Marketing Edge on TV, a half-hour content-rich potpourri of news, jest and development in the IMC sector spiced with industry conversations by highly placed professionals on a weekly basis. The Marketing Edge on TV is another replication of Marketing Edge magazine rich, robust, and very stimulating. Marketing Edge on TV, which goes on air every Wednesday on TVC DSTV channel 418 between 12.30 and 1 p.m. and now live on WAP TV, DSTV channel 262 every 8.30 p.m. on Wednesday and a repeat broadcast, same station, 9.30 a.m. on Thursdays of every week has become another veritable platform in promoting the brand idea. It has also further expanded the frontiers in educating, entertaining, informing, and agenda certain, thereby creating another unique selling point and unrivaled competitive advantage. Hello and welcome to Marketing Edge on TV, Nigerians' leading initiative in the business of brand management and the management of brand business. It is a the weekly TV show, now in its third year, has continued to work stronger, attracting continuously enlarging viewership while drawing more adherents of the Nigerian broadcast media audience to itself. Ever since the launch of Marketing Edge on TV, the Nigerian marketing and advertising in ecosystem has never been the same. Marketing Edge on TV has fully redefined brand journalism while upscaling the brand equity of the foremost marketing and advertising publications. Through Marketing Edge on TV, a larger spectrum of the Nigerian TV viewing audience are now better educated, informed and entertained by the basic marketing information and tips. Marketing Edge on TV, I must confess, is one of the products of our innovative thinking. Having practiced journalism for like about this the dawn of journalism for like 70 years, we discovered that a large, a, a large section of the, of the Nigerian populace are still not uh, abreast of developments. We are still not abreast of developments and happenings in the brand management sector. We discovered that, unlike in politics, very few people know why, know the meaning of even a brand, neither do they even know why they even patronize of brands. So, if in further taking the knowledge expansion to the mass populace, we created the Marketing Edge on TV, which serves as a replication of the print edition of Marketing Edge. In Marketing Edge on TV, we have three major pivotal voter sectors. We have brand news, we have brand in focus, then of course we have industry conversation. Other brand news, we report latest developments, news, authoritative news on the market situations in Nigeria and the key players in the sector. Other brand in focus, from time to time, we will we, we do a, a review, an editorial review of different brands and products in the market sector. We also do special focus on organizations and institutions, and even individuals. Because again, individuals are also brands. We call them personality brands in market. Then, of course, in industry, other industry conversation, we engage practitioners, be it in the creative agencies, 
experiential marketing or PR or the brand owners in contemporary and topical issues that centers on the industry. This we do regularly to, to bridge the gap between the brands and the consumers. And of course, to bridge the gap between the, 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 the knowledge gap between the public and the Nigeria market and advertising ecosystem. It's inaugural quarterly virtual IMC summit. And not done in its pursuit of creative disruption, Marketing Edge last year initiated a quarterly virtual summit aimed at constructive and proactive intellectual engagement of industry gurus and titans on contemporary issues in marketing and advertising. The quarterly virtual summit, which has gained preeminence amongst industry players, has become another veritable platform in knowledge sharing, peer reviews, and deep market insights across all sectors of the industry. This pioneering initiative by Marketing Edge has strongly repositioned the brand as a go-to resource media platform. And past edition series of the summit held virtually have featured seasoned marketers, renowned advertising professionals, digital mavens, and leading OOH players, PR professionals, as well as accomplished brand experience headhunters. Indeed, the Marketing Edge Quarterly Virtual Summit has become a much sought after platform by cerebral professionals and industry juggernauts eager and ready to unleash their creative powers while setting new standards in the industry. It has been a worthwhile effort of all these while as the quarterly summit continues to offer fresh market insights while serving as an avenue for global benchmark and market competitiveness. The quarterly virtual summit which we have had now for like about almost a year and a half now has been very, very productive. During the virtual summit, thanks to COVID-19, we get players across the world to participate with the local players on contemporary issues. In other words, Marketing Edge quarterly virtual summit has helped to constantly engineer changes at global levels, not only in Nigeria. Our people, are exposed to networking, idea sharing, a peer review within them and across the globe because we get we don't, we don't we don't really get players or participants from different parts of the country of the world and this has robustly helped in global benchmark global performance benchmark for Nigerian players. And again, it has helped to intellectualize what we do. And the industry is quite excited about this. It is worthy of mention that the Marketing Edge brand wowed the industry two years ago when it partnered leading out-of-home companies to launch online news headline on LED digital billboards in major metropolis across the country. The initiative, which came as a bang in the Nigerian print media sector, has further raised the bar of journalism practice while deepening digital transformation in the genre of brand journalism. Through this unique initiative, key headline news on Marketing Edge Online are streamed live on iconic LOH-led structures pan Nigeria. This pioneering initiative has enriched public knowledge about the industry while helping Marketing Edge publication to continue living up to expectations as an agenda-setting platform. The gesture which has fundamentally altered the marketing and advertising landscape remains a great fancy and attraction to the industry. We thought to ourselves that there cannot be any limits in promoting the brand idea. And that prompted us to have a partnership relationship with major players in the Nigeria out of home sector. We discovered that using the LED to reach the Nigerian consumer we go a long way in eradicating the poverty of ideas. You know, the brand vision, the brand mission, 
and the brand promise can better be appreciated through direct communication, which the LEDB board serves a thousand and one consumers on a daily basis. And the brand, the players, we, I must confess, I thank those guys for sharing the same vision with us. They do it as a public service initiative, and they've been able to appreciate the essence of communicating the, 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 the brand value and brand benefits to the Nigerian public as a way of further enhancing the knowledge of marketing and advertising in Nigeria. It's been very wonderful. As if all of these are not enough, Marketing Edge launched daily digital newsletters to further expand the frontiers of marketing knowledge. The newsletter, which features exclusive news, gist and happenings in the industry on a regular basis, has become a major companion to all stakeholders. We make bold to say that the magazine now serves industry players hot and sizzling exclusive and authoritative news that are very organic in all aspects and ramifications in the true DNA of Marketing Edge. It is a platform like no other as it has become an adjunct media platform to penetrate the industry more widely and globally than ever before. Our daily digital newsletter has been very wonderful in not only reaching out to industry players, but again, as I must say, to a cross section, a, a, a large section of the Nigerian public. Through the daily newsletter, we generate organic news stories that touch the hearts of the Nigerian market. The newsletter helps us in providing deep market insights on developments in the Nigerian markets. And since we started this publication, the story has never been the same again. A lot of people who were either to not knowledgeable or about the market insights, they now get to know more about the, about, about the markets. You don't go to, a, a consumer does not just go to the market blindly without having an idea about, hey, when, who, what does this brand represent? Am I just going to buy a product for the sake of buying it? What benefits does it offer me? What value does it offer me? So we're very proud of the fact that we were able to initiate this idea to further help in bridging the knowledge gap. And still focusing in the culture and traditions of innovation, Marketing Edge Management, again, earlier this year, introduced Marketing Edge Hall of Fame. They are the word on the street. Their names are on everyone's lips. They have earned their stripes in their chosen field and taken the world by storm with their talents, skills, grit, grace, and just the right amount of crazy. And now, they are singled out for honors in the premier edition of the Marketing Edge Hall of Fame. The initiative initiated not only to honor trailblazers and accomplished leaders in the industry is also aimed at inspiring the next generation while restoring hope and confidence about the potentials in the IMC sector. The men and women inducted into the Marketing Edge Hall of Fame have impacted outstandingly on the industry with footprints on the sands of time. Identifying and recognizing these industry icons through the Marketing Edge Hall of Fame has been described as the best that has ever happened to the Nigerian market and advertising sector over the decades. It has become another metric in measuring and determining those who make things happen across the IMC sector, be the old or younger generation. We came up with the Hall of Fame as it was especially recognizing titans and gurus in the Nigeria market environments. We, and again, this recognition goes across industries. For you to be called to the Marketing Edge Hall of Fame, you must have excelled. You must have been a star of, in your profession. And you must have been an achiever. No doubt, uh, the, 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 our past honorees have been people that have seen it all. These are gurus of the of various industries and these are pay setters and pathfinders that have 
left their footprints and are still leaving their footprints on the sand of time through their different innovations, ideas, and lifelong contributions to both national and global economy. They are leaders with their eyes. The introduction of Marketing Edge Hall of Fame has no doubt set a new standard in performance measurement and career achievement assessment as well as review. We are flying the flag for this current generation and as leader of the new school that has to hand over the responsibility to the next generation. I think this just shows to everyone that it is possible that uh, we can be honored and we can be inducted into the Hall of Fame for Marketing Edge. So thank you so much for the privilege and I feel very humbled. The thank yous are so great because at this stage of life when people still tell you thank you, I think it's a great honor having spent over 30 years in the industry. So I say thank you very much to Marketing Edge. And what I always want to commend you is the pioneering role. You know, putting a, a Hall of Fame, I mean, that says something, especially in this day and age where everything goes on the internet of things. So I'll just bask in the whole of, Hall of Fame for a few minutes and enjoy the, what do you say, the attention. <laughs> thank you very much. I would like to plead that many more people join John. They need to join so that there will be much more di diverse reportage and coverage of the things that we do, particularly the way that this business has gone now or the way this business is going now. It's so dynamic. And you also need people to understand um, technology to report on the kind of thing that, that you guys are doing. So I think on behalf of all of us, I'd like to thank John and his team for a wonderful evening. Once again, just to say thank you to John and uh, his team at Marketing Edge. Uh, we, we first knew about John when I know he was working with a gentleman called Aki Adioya. And both of them combined so effectively to cover the industry. Um, I don't know what happened to Aki Adioya. I didn't hear about him anymore. But um, John took up the mantle and really, really, he has gone, he has come a very long way. And I want to congratulate him for the efforts he has put in and the success that he has made as of today. Marketing Edge are part of the history of the formation of Marketing Edge. And uh, this dates back to many years back when I became the chief executive for Upcon. But prior to that, I had a little relationship with the publisher himself when I was chairman of Pillars. He gave me a wonderful support. Uh, then he, didn't, he, he did not start Market Edge at that time. So what I did when I came into office, I invited him and said, look, Ajay, you have been very nice to me. How do we uh, do the bargain now? And I'm happy. I said he should do something that we could support him. And today, um, he's bigger than me. That's history. That's Nigeria. That's what's supposed to be. When you mentor people, they become bigger than you, they admit there is progress.